Hey friends, welcome back. We made it through winter break and F1 is finally back. Here are five things we are looking forward to as the new 2024 season begins. There have been rumours circulating about team principal Fred Vasseur's plans since the announcement of Hamilton joining the team in 2025. Numerous key figures from other teams have been linked, suggesting that something remarkable may be happening in the upcoming seasons. Furthermore, the internal team at Ferrari has spoken positively about the changes made since Vasseur's arrival. His objectives for the team are clear, making it easy for the team to follow suit. They hope that the overall ambition can help bring the team back to the top. Will this be the end of Ferrari's title-winning drought? Mercedes struggled last season and switched from their zero-pod design to a new one inspired by Red Bull. As a result, they have extensively redesigned their new 2024 Challenger, including changing from a pull-rod suspension to a push-rod design. They have also moved the driving position back by at least 100 millimetres, which was an issue with Lewis Hamilton, their star driver. James Allison, Mercedes' technical director, believes that this new design philosophy will allow for more improvements and developments than their previous approach. The question is, can Mercedes turn things around and give Hamilton a chance to compete for race wins or even the championship? As Mercedes moved away from the zero pods design, the current world champions surprised the entire F1 paddock by adopting the same concept to evolve the RB20 further. Reports suggest that the Red Bull team will switch to a more advanced version of the zero-pod concept from the Japanese GP as cooler temperatures allow them to push the boundaries of car design and potentially dominate the upcoming races. However, there are questions as Mercedes struggled with the same concept earlier. Will Red Bull succeed where Mercedes failed? The Red Bull team is also being closely examined as allegations against their team principal are still being investigated. Sources say there is tension between Adrian Newey and Horner, as well as Verstappen's father. Will this tension affect their performance in the new season? The McLaren team, based in Woking, was one of the teams that performed well in the last season. They underwent some changes in their management and design team under the leadership of Andrea Stella. The team has been performing solidly and came close to challenging Red Bull in both qualifying and races. The team has been tight-lipped about their 2024 challenger, but they have mentioned that they have worked extensively on several key areas, including their slow cornering and low grip conditions during the winter break. The team has access to their new wind tunnel and simulator, which were heavily used while developing the MCL38. The driver lineup of Oscar Piastri and Lando Norris is also one of the strongest on the current F1 grid. If McLaren can keep up with in-season development, they can be a real headache for the Red Bull F1 team. The question, however, remains. Can McLaren challenge for victories and championships again? Last year, during pre-season testing, Aston Martin had the second-best performing car after Red Bull. The car appeared to be well-balanced and responsive, which translated to frequent podium finishes and strong qualifying and race performances in the first half of the season. However, the team's fortunes took a turn for the worse after the summer break. This caused frustration and anger for their two drivers. Alonso mentioned several times that the team was struggling to get the setup right, while Lance Stroll had issues with the overall balance and feel of the car. For the upcoming 2024 season, the team has claimed to have addressed their weaknesses and is focusing on competing with Red Bull and other major rivals. Can Alonso secure a victory? or will he be forced to switch teams once again? The upcoming 2024 racing season is shaping up to be a thrilling event, with numerous driver moves, controversies, and allegations already circulating before it even begins. Will Red Bull's dominance come to an end, or will the reigning champions sweep the competition? Can any other teams step up to the challenge? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you enjoyed this video, Please leave a comment, share with your friends and subscribe for more exciting content.